All right. This is we're on Mount Rainier, and we can see a couple mountains. And Tracy is going to belay me into a crevasse, which is down there. Kind of looks like that. So we're practicing crevasse rescue. So those guys are supposedly going to save me, but I'm going to get very awkwardly right here, and then I'm going to go down into that. All right, ready, Tracy? Yep. Everyone ready? We're not ready yet. You can ready? Go in, I, I got gotcha. you. All right, I'm going in. All right, I'm probably gonna slip off of this. Ooh, that's a long way down. Yep. Yeah, it's leashed. All right, here I go. Whoops. Oh, that's a little scary. Look how deep down that goes. Not too bad. How's it going, Tracy? <laughs> Make sure you wave to me with your non-break hand. Whoa, a little slippery. So I think this is how 128 hours or whatever started. Look at those clouds. Whoa, a little unnerving, but I'm all tied in here with my chest harness, double tied in with a couple ropes here. So not too worried. Sounds it's really quiet in here. There's the opening. So we're simulating if we were walking along a glacier, which we're on a glacier right now, and uh, something like this, we were to fall through an ice bridge into something like this. This is a crevasse, and a crevasse happens when you have a glacier and it's, the glacier is basically a slow moving river of ice. And a crevasse happens when this huge slow moving layer of ice is going over some sort of a, like a hump. So you get these big cracks. And you can see that ice bridge right about there. So that kind of continues on that way. But this part just happens to be open. So that's where we're going can see it's very cave-like icicles all over the place a little melty and that is what's below me Ooh, there's some very loud noises in here too because this is an active an active ice uh, an active glacier so it's extremely hot today. Uh, it's probably about 75 degrees and in the sun it's even hotter, but it's nice and cool down here, which I really like. So I'm just gonna chill here for a while and wait for the uh, crevasse rescue people to pull me up on this rope. And Tracy has me backed up on this rope just in case they don't quite know how to do it, but I trust them. They'll get me out of here alive. So, yeah, anyway, hello. It's fun being in a grass. All right. See you later.